Hello everybody, it's Fozzy Mash, and this is a tutorial for 60 FPS clips for people who, who don't have a capture card or they just have a capture card that can't record in 30 FPS. Uh, this tutorial is ideal for people who want to get their clips edited by editors, but they only ask for 60 FPS clips because they want to use effects like Twixter without a ghosting. So I just got, you have to go to theatre mode, I've got already got a clip. So here's a clip I've got. I'm going to start recording it, but you have to make sure it's recording at 0 0.5 speed. Okay, so it's messed up there a little bit. So you put the speed to 0 0.5. And I just record it from there. Uh, the reason I'm going to be 0 0.5, I'll, meant, I'll explain the tutorial later. So that's my clip. Now I'm just going to upload it. So what I'm going to do now guys is render it so it goes to YouTube. So if you have PS3 or Xbox or you can just link it with your YouTube channel or render there. So select your clip and you select render video. It's going to take some time. So I'm back and I'm on my computer. So what I've got my clip on my desktop right here. I've downloaded it off YouTube. So you just use your YouTube converter to download it. And if you have Sony Vegas, you just bring your clip in. And you make sure to disable resample. It's really important. And now we just watch it. This is what it looks like. Now, it's not really, it's, the clip is 30 frames per second, but it's in a project with uh, a project of 50 frames per second. So, after every frame you move, one will be the same as the previous one because it's 50 frames per second. So, what we're going to do is go to properties and put the playback rate at 2 and shorten it to that part. And you watch it, and it looks like normal speed now. And it looks a lot smoother than a 30 FPS clip, but you can't really see it because YouTube doesn't play um, in 50 FPS. But trust me, it actually does work. And you don't have to have Sony Vegas to do this. You can have a Windows Movie Maker. Most of you should have it. If not, you can just download it, it's not that hard. And you just browse your videos put the clip in let's wait this to load oh when you go to when you're rendering it you have to create a custom setting with the dimensions just use these dimensions make sure the frame rate is 59.94 and yeah just do that let's save that there so now it's loaded you go to you go to video tools and you put the speed at 2 so it looks like normal speed and it's gonna use that preset that I, used, that I just made and render it to my desktop. That's ready. So this is the one I just made right now and it's 60 FPS and you don't have to there is no option for disabling resample in Windows Movie Maker because there's no flicker when you render stuff and you can do this with any Call of Duty so like or any Call of Duty that theater like Black Ops, Modern Warfare 3, Black Ops 2 
and that's it for this tutorial thanks for watching I hope this helped I know it's gonna help a lot of people who want they want to get their clips edited this is Fuzzy Manash and I'm out